our um, typical buildings or typical homes that we design for our uh, customers uh, save on average about 18% uh, uh, energy um, uh, compared to the Saudi building code. So obviously it's very important for us uh, to, to, be, uh, to keep, uh, keep abreast of what is happening uh, on the global uh, uh, scene. Um, uh, we are present uh, as part of the Saudi delegation. We are uh, uh, present, representing the company at one of the panels of the Ministry of Energy, uh, talking about uh, smart city and energy resiliency. Um, that is, a, 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 like I mentioned earlier, it's, it's, it's an important thing for us. We, we, all, we build communities within existing cities, so, so our integration is important. Um, uh, in addition to scouting and understanding what's happening with trends and peers and, and, and vendors and suppliers, and also being uh, uh, abreast of, of uh, what the uh, trends are moving forward, specifically when it comes to uh, decarbonization and, and also financing of those, those efforts. Um, what we're trying to do is, is increase that. Uh, uh, to 40, 50 percent uh, through energy efficiency measures. Now, technically, to get there, it's 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 feasible. Uh, financially, is where we need to do, get a bit uh, more innovative. So we know uh, uh, today that that we can get there uh, if we have unlimited amounts of money. But obviously, uh, that cascades to the end user. So uh, what we're trying to do is 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 get into a part, you know, creative partnerships and and purchasing agreements and, and and technologies to allow us to meet uh, or increase this 18%, but also not affect uh, uh, the purchasing pr uh, uh, price uh, of, of our end customer.